Hey everyone, this is Megan with Able Cine and I'm here with a first look at Fujinon's Primista 28 to 100 millimeter zoom lens. Now let's talk about the name first. The name is derived from the word Premier, which is the top of the line lenses in the Fujinon family, as well as VistaVision, which tells you that this lens covers full format cameras. The lens has an image circle of 46.3, which means it will cover the full format cameras out there. Right now I have it on a Sony Venice, as you can see, but that means it will also cover the full sensor of the Red Monstro, the Airy LF, the Airy LF Mini, and the Canon C700. Let's talk about some other design elements of the lens. It has a 114 millimeter front diameter, which is a really common diameter. It's really nice because it will work with a 4x5 clip-on matte box, as well as uh, sunshades and regular 4x5 matte boxes as well. It is a T29, which is very fast for a full format zoom, and also the close focus is 2 feet and 8 inches. I wanted to show it in a lightweight setup here because the lens is just over eight pounds, which will definitely lend itself to handheld setups, as well as, of course, Steadicam and studio modes as well. I'm actually gonna shoot with it later today, and I am going to work with it in a handheld mode. A couple other interesting things about this lens is there's actually a hex screw towards the back of the lens that allows you to change the flange depth. So that's really great for owner operators, rental houses that need to make an adjustment if it has changed over time with either heat or cold changes. This lens also works with the Zeiss extended data system via the LIMO port on the top of the zoom. There will be a sister lens, which will be the 80 to 250 millimeter Premista, and that lens will be out by the end of the year. One thing to note is that these two lenses will be the same size and weight, which is really great for camera assistants and operators out there, which means when you make a lens change, we don't have to change the entire configuration. So between these two lenses, by the end of the year, Fujinon will cover full format from 28 millimeter all the way to 250 millimeter, which is a really great range. But even with this one lens here, which is 28 to 100 millimeter, that really is a, a significant range. When I was thinking about it earlier, I was thinking about a typical prime set that I would rent, and that really does cover the focal lengths that we typically use. Unless, of course, for an extreme close-up, we might rent something in addition. But I just wanted to point out that this focal range is really nice for one lens. So let's take a look at how the lens actually looks. So in a minute, I'm gonna shoot some different color charts. We're gonna look at flare, bokeh, and skin tone in a couple different environments. Thank you everyone for watching and be sure to check out this lens when it ships this summer.